What's up guys, James here with Fun Fact of the Day. Hope you guys are having a great day, learning lots, and getting stuff done. Today, I'm here to talk about something I hear all the time at the gym and anytime anybody I know has a drug test coming up at work. And that is, I'm gonna sweat out all the toxins from my body by going in the sauna. Well, is that a myth or is it true? The question is, can you actually sweat out toxins? You see it all the time on Instagram with people advertising for fit teas and Bikram yoga and sweaty this and hot that. Is it an actual thing? Can you sweat toxins out of your body to make yourself healthier? Well, the simple answer to that is no, you cannot. You can, technically, but in most of the studies I've read, the amount of toxins that you actually sweat out are so minuscule that they mean nothing. It will be something like one ten thousandth of a microgram of alcohol in the entire sweat from your body. It's literally nothing. Because sweat is just water and salt. It comes from the plasma of your blood. And so, it actually is worse for the toxins in your body. It concentrates them. It's something called hemoconcentration. You see, when you sweat, all the plasma from your blood is leaving your arms and droves. But everything else in your blood, all the toxins, all the blood cells, all the platelets, everything else stays behind. So you just have more toxins per amount of fluid in your body, which makes it worse. And then your liver, kidneys, and intestines that actually filter out all the toxins in your body have a much more difficult time filtering them out because they need water to do their jobs. So when you dehydrate by sweating, it just makes everything worse. So next time you have a drug test coming up at work, I would recommend just drinking a ton of water and it will help flush out the toxins by using your liver, your kidneys, and your intestines which are the things that actually flush out toxins. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like down below. Please note that I am not a doctor in any way. This is all just coming from textbooks and things that I've learned in the past, plus studies and advice from other actual doctors. So please don't sue me for malpractice. Anyway, please leave a comment down below on a time that you sweated everywhere and it ruined your day. And if you haven't already, consider subscribing. We put out new videos every single day, and they're all right here in a playlist just for you in case you feel like binge watching them like a Netflix show. That's all for me today, and I will see you tomorrow.